types of death are not covered in term insurance plans. Well, this just applies not only to term insurance, but any type of life insurance plan. And it's quite natural that specifically when you're going in for a large amount of cover as in term insurance, you want to be absolutely sure that your nominee will get the claim in case uh, the death of the policy holder happens. So in life insurance, usually all types of death are covered. Uh, there are only very few exceptions which are there. And, and they're very specific in nature. So a normal person doesn't really have to worry about what kind of death is covered and not covered in, in a term insurance plan. The specific cases in which it is not covered, the first is a suicide case. And that to in case the policyholder commits suicide within a year of taking the plan, then the cover benefits are not paid out. The premiums are just returned back to the uh, nominee and the entire cover amount so if you've taken a cover of a 50 lakh or a crore that's not paid out but only the premiums which you have paid are returned back to the nominee the other big uh, exclusion is suppose you're indulging in an illegal activity and death has happened because of that i mean illegal uh, then the claims will not be honored so in case you know you cause or you're involved in an accident when which you were drunk and driving so you were actually doing something illegal, then the claim will not be honored. So it could be any kind of illegal activity which you're doing and death, death happens because of that, then the claim will get rejected. So broadly, these are the only reasons, you know, some criminal activity, illegal uh, scenario is, is primarily what you need to be concerned about. And as I said, most normal people don't really indulge in such activities. So you really don't need to be too concerned about this. However, just you know, just to double check, uh, some policies might have certain exclusions written in the fine print. So once you get the policy documents, spend some 15-20 minutes going through the fine print, go through it and, and see if there are any special clauses mentioned, uh, which you think are, you know, contradictory to what was communicated to you or when you saw the brochure, those things were not mentioned. Uh, it's, it's a 30 year, 25 year old pl uh, plan for you taking a cover, a, a large cover for your family. So I think you can spend 15 to 20 minutes just going through the policy documents once. And in case you're not satisfied, uh, you can return the plan within 15 days of uh, you receiving the policy documents and the entire premiums will get returned to you. I hope this clarifies this topic. Happy to take any questions. Do comment in the section below and we'll be happy. And we'll surely get back to you. Thank you. So here's how you can do a term insurance comparison in a Jiffy. Log on to your browser and type myinsuranceclub.com. Press go or enter. Select term plans from the list of options shown. Now select the amount of cover which you would like to have. Then select the term of the policy or the duration of the policy. Enter your date of birth followed by gender and whether you consume tobacco or not, enter your city of residence, followed by your basic details, name, mobile number and email ID. We do not share any of these contact details with any partner or vendor. So it's completely uh, between you as a customer and my insurance club. So show plans will take you to the list of options from different insurance companies. Almost all the major term insurance uh, plans are covered here for a comparison. So by default, they're listed uh, sorted by popularity. That means the maximum number of people who have actually clicked or uh, shown interest in a particular plan. You can check the plans from various insurance companies. The claims ratio is displayed. The payout benefits which you get in every plan is displayed. Further, there are a host of filters given on this page. You want to change your amount of cover. That can be done. You want to change the policy term. So you can select by number of years or till an age which you want. So you want till the age of 70. You want annual premiums, half yearly premiums, quarterly or monthly. A host of riders are available so you can select 
the ones which you would want and a few more filters in terms of a premium range and any particular set of insurance companies which you want to select and lastly you can sort the search results by popularity premium or claims ratio so as you see quite an exhaustive comparison can be done on this page of my insurance club i hope this is useful